Hello everybody, so today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about differential equation. So now I will show you how to answer. So this one we can put into 3 over s square minus y over s square. y square divided by y square, you got about 1 over s s divided by s, we have negative number 2 over y square. Next, we put about p equals to this one, and q equals to this one. So, because we have the s, so we need to do first the derivative of the function of b with respect to y. So we just have only y in here. So if we do first the derivative of this one, we will have about negative 1 over s square. We have dy. So we need to do first the derivative of the function of q with respect to s. So we just have only 1 over s. And this one you have negative 1 over s square. So this one equal to this one. So that's it about exact. So we need to set up about the function f s y equals to the interaction of this one in here plus g s y. The interaction of three over s square in here, we will have about negative three over s. The interaction of this one we will have about positive y over s because the interaction of negative 1 over s square you got about 1 over s. Next, we need to do first the derivative of the function with respect to y for the both side in here. So this one we don't have y, you got about 0. This one we have y, so we have 1 over s. And we know that everything in here equals to this one. Now we simplify 1 over s for the both sides. Next, we put the interaction for the both sides. The interaction of this one, we have negative 1 over y, and we put about c. Negative with negative, so we will have about 2 over y. And we know that this one is about 3sy. Now we return back to here. So we put 2 over y going here. And we know that everything in here equals to fsy and fsy equal to c. So we simplify this one. You will have like this. Next, we have the condition in here. That means when s equal to negative number 1, y equals to number 2. So we put negative number 1 in here. Negative number 1 in here. y equal to number 2 we put in here. To find the value of c. And we got about number 2. So we put number 2 in here. This is the end. Thank you for watching.